Terry. Talk to you then. We're back on Zero Tackle. Oh, I've missed you. I've missed you too. And I've, I've missed, missed Zero Tackle. I've missed, yeah, I always miss Zero Tackle. Best rugby league side out there, mm -hmm. especially that Dan Nichols boat. You guys are right. Uh, we're here to talk quick fire. So let's put five minutes on the... Uh... First up, it looks like Stephen Crichton is going to sign a lucrative deal for to join the Canterbury Bulldogs. His management has come out to Penrith and put your best table on the offer. However, they know he's going to get fullback money and the opportunity to play fullback for the dogs. Like it or hate it? Love it. Hate it. Love it, love it, love it. He's going to go there and he's going to lift the Bulldogs to uh, probably a comfortable seventh place position. Bloke's worth a lot more money than what he's getting paid. I think he's wasted in the centres. I think he'll be a superstar fullback. Plus, it makes Penrith considerably weaker, which is always a positive. I don't see him being a superstar fullback. I see him being a fullback that will be average and end up back in the centres. Now, one of the things, one of the best things about Stephen Crichton and people are saying to me, but he's one of the best defensive centres. Yeah, that's because he reads it in the front line. His yeah. tackling stats are actually quite poor. It's going to take... It's, look, it's, it's yeah. a big risk, but I think it's one that he has to take. I don't think it's worth it. I, I think you should go to the dogs, but he's just going to end up in the centres anyway. So just go there and play in the centres. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, Tessie New, immediate release from the Brisbane Broncos to join the Dolphins. Like it or hate it? It is what it is. I, I got, I'm neutral to this, like with most... Dolphins related matters. He improves their side. He walks into a centre position. I think Tessie New, as a player, has a lot more potential than what he's shown. I just don't think that they're putting money in the positions that are needed. I think they're just taking anyone who's available. I think you're right there, and you're saying that he hasn't shown the potential and this for him a change of scenery. Now he's still in Queensland. Kind of would have liked him to go to Newcastle. Mm. Uh, but for him now to go into the centres, right? So Hammer's going to be their fullback because they paid big money to get him in a release. Uh, Tessie knew he was on a relatively modest contract at Brisbane. He's on the same modest contract now. He's going to go into the centres, give himself an opportunity. I feel that the Dolphins have made the right decision here because this is money that needed to be spent for a backline because their backline's dross. Fair enough. The English Super League are trialling a rule, Dan, that if you stay down with an injury... Mm -hmm. The video referee deems there's no foul place. There's no head high. There's no chicken wing grapple, anything else. No crusher tackle. And you stay down injured, you have to go off for three minutes for medical attention, and you cannot be replaced unless it's interchanged. So essentially, your team is down a player for three minutes because you took a dive. Now, that's not to say that you didn't hurt your knee or your yeah. foot or anything, and you may need medical attention, but you're off three minutes. I love this, and if it goes well in the Super League, I want to see it in the NRL quick mm. smart. Now, the obvious thing is, what if what if you're genuinely injured? We're going to get subbed off anyways. Yep. So this is a no-lose situation. Mm -hmm. I, I believe that the, the milking has come back a lot, yeah. but it did creep in last year, so let's get rid of it again. Yeah, someone said to me, well, what happens if they've torn their ACL? Well, they're going to hospital. You yeah. gotta get interchanged. But if you're having a sook, you're off for three minutes. Love it. John Bateman has signed a four-year deal to the West Tigers. Now, I read something today that Wigan have received more money in transfer fees for John Bateman than they've ever paid him. Wigan, elite club status. Fantastic. Fantastic signing for the Tigers. I don't think he was particularly great for Wigan last year, and I am a Wigan fan, full disclosure. Uh, I think he'll improve with as good as Wigan are, you know, they're probably Newcastle in the NRL. I think he'll come and he'll play exceptionally well. I think it's a risk the Tigers had to make. I think it's one that will play big dividends in the end, but this is a bloke who's never fulfilled a contract before. The risk is there. The risk is there. I think it's a great signing. The Tigers now have one of the best back rows, Isaiah Papali'i, uh, John Bateman and Joel Fan That's real good. I think that's a fantastic, fantastic uh, back row there. I think it's a great signing. They needed to take the pun on him. They've just got to keep him happy. Yeah, which should be hard because it's sunny and it's not England. So there's two. But it is Campbelltown. And Look, it is the Tigers and Tim Sheens is the coach. They'll win a lot of games. Uh, Lockie Miller has asked the Cronulla Sharks for a release. And in return, Cronulla has said, we will grant you a release if Newcastle uh, give us a player in return. One of the players that we're looking at is Tyson Frizzell. But I know we're not going to talk about what we want. We're going to talk about Lachlan Miller. Your thoughts, Dan? I think Cronulla hold all the cards and Newcastle need to come to the table with something that Cronulla want or Cronulla tell them to go away. Because Lockie Miller f probably doesn't make the, the round one side, but he's the second best fullback at Cronulla for mine. Some would argue he's perhaps even the best. So for Newcastle to get him, they're going to have to give us something that we want. We don't owe Lockie Miller anything. Let's not let him go unless there's a player that we 
The ball's what? in our court. Absolutely. Yeah, the ball's in our court. We say, you know, we, we will release you if we get something in return. It's on you to go to Newcastle now and say, if you want Make me, it happen. you got to make it happen. Otherwise, I'm going to play for Newtown. And then when you get me for 2024, I've got another fight on my hand for fullback. I think Cronulla keep him. 